What's up guys? Joe here from Back to Basics.fit. Today I wanted to make another video on toughening up the knuckles and the wrists for fighting, for boxing, for MMA. I have another video on it, but I keep getting questions about it, so I thought I'd go into something else that I didn't really cover in my last video. So the topic I want to cover today is what's known as Wolf's Law. It basically states that a bone in a healthy human being or animal will adapt to the stress under which it's placed. So uh, you see this a lot in other countries like Japan for example with the uh, Makiwara board. I believe I pronounced that correctly. You know, they punch, they punch at the board to not only strengthen up the knuckles, but learn how to direct power from their hit. I don't have the Makiwara board, but one thing that I do is after my normal rounds on the punching bag, which sometimes I do with no gloves, or other times I just do with really light bag gloves. I really don't wear big, thick, heavy, like boxing gloves when I hit the bag. And I really don't wrap my hands all that much. Every now and then I will, but for the most part I either just hit it bare fist or I hit it with just some old school bag gloves or even some garden gloves. But here, this is a, it looks like crap, but it doesn't matter. It's, it, I only use it for this purpose and to carry it. It's just a bag of quick creep wrapped in duct tape but I opened up a little slit in it when it rained one night so it kind of got it got harder than usual so I, I started off on something like this and basically what you're trying to do is you're not trying to like punch through it and give it all your power at first you just want to make contact with it just, just get to the point where you start to Strengthen it up. You can also drop hammer fist on it, back hands on it, but just start off light. It's going to be uncomfortable at first, but then pretty soon you'll start getting to the point if you're careful where you can really start to hit it a lot harder. Still, though, I'm striking it and pulling away. I'm really not trying to go through it. So, you can start off with something like that. If you don't have something like this, you could also take, this is just two pieces of wood right here. Normally I would just put them on the ground. You can put a towel or something over it, and then you can do the same thing. It's obviously gonna be a little harder than this. Same thing, you just start off kind of getting the feel for it. Then over time, they'll be able to hit it a lot harder and then you can move on to something like this block where again you want to just take it light at first it's like so so yeah check it out wolf's law i'll link another video john hackleman the trainer of chuck liddell he has an excellent video on it as well. Uh, it's, so it's out there in the mixed martial arts community, in the martial arts world. So yeah, Wolf's Law. Check it out, read about it, give it a try. Don't blame me if you get hurt. I'm just telling you what's out there. Start off light, and yeah, until next time, let me know what you guys want to see next. Peace.